Hi, this is Dr. Missick, and the topic today is Esther sings with excitement before sleeping with the king, Roman numeral two. So here we go. Let me sing a song. I'm loving you. I don't know what to do. I'm loving you. I'm dancing to loving you. Show me what to do. Loving you. I'm happy to. I want you to turn to, it says, the Song of Songs 2. Yes, chapter 2 in your Bible. And look at verse 3. It says, young woman, three, like the finest apple tree in the orchard is my lover among other young men. I sit in his delightful shade and taste his delicious fruit. He escorts me to the banquet hall. It's obvious how much he loves me, strengthen me with his raisin cakes, refresh me with apples. I am weak with love. His left arm is under my head, and his right arm embraces me. Promise me, O oh women of Jerusalem, by the gazelles and wild deer, not to awaken love until the time is right. So you see, there are a lot of things about love mentioned in the Bible. And we're going to go through a lot more a little later as we talk about the importance of love and the importance of the relationship between male and female. And if we just look at the Song of Songs, verse chapter 3, Verse 1, I'm just going to read one thing. It says, One night as I lay in bed, I yearned for my lover. I yearned for him, but he did not come. So, just that alone tells us that there's a yearning there. There's a longing there for love. And we have to think that we, as human beings, we have yearnings, we have desires, we have needs, we have hopes, we have things within our souls where we have promises where we ourselves make within ourselves. And so we have to think about the good things in life because without those hopes, desires, and needs, and yearnings, what is life? Life is empty. And so back to that song. I'm loving you. I don't know what to do. I'm loving you. I'm needing you. I'm loving you. I'm dancing for you. I'm loving you. I'm hoping for you. I'm loving you. Just singing for you. Loving you, I'm cooing for you. Loving you, I don't know what to do. Loving you, I don't know what to do.